car so good today, right? Knock on wood. Sebastian is off to school. He's probably at school. He's probably getting ready to buy his breakfast. Number two, because he had cereal. But it's mac and cheese day at the school. I didn't have to make him a lunch. I had a hot shower for the first time in a couple weeks and I didn't need to wear my coat outside. It was about 60 and I would have normally had to still wear my coat because I was getting so cold every morning. So that was amazing. It was so nice. I could cry. It was so nice getting into that water. But yeah, we're just continuing on the day. I'm gonna do a lot of laundry, vacuuming upstairs, cleaning. I've got drawers for underneath Sebastian's bed coming so I can put his clothes away in his new room and clean up the nursery a little bit just because we're gonna be moving through there. No, I don't know if I'll be moving through there a lot, but we're gonna probably have to pile up some things in there. Use it as storage, but time to make breakfast and lunch.
Hello everyone from our very echoey bathroom. Can you tell we have not bothered to clean in the past couple weeks? Because it is all getting thrown away. <laughs> We're gonna save this cabinet that was here when we moved in a million years ago. You can see the walls were white and then we had them painted tan and whatever this painting company used for the tan paint, it ripped like crazy. So, yeah, and then I did the blue. <laughs> we're gonna save it. Danny thinks maybe the basement bathroom might be a project at some point and he could put it in there. But I assume he's gonna take all of these down. They might be good in that bathroom too. He had to stop because it was getting too late and the electric girl was noisy, but the curtains are down. Well, blinds, because they're going to need the paint in there and we also don't want them to get damaged or paper. Anyway, I was in there a lot, cleaning out. We've got... Oh my goodness, I was filming and I didn't actually push the button. The hello! As you saw, we moved out of the bathroom, and we are all moved into this one. Family of four, shower in a shower. It's a little steamy because I just sent Jax to shower so that I would have the bathroom when it's time for me to get ready. Also him, but it looks like he did most of his thing, so that's good. We are all loaded up in here. I guess we're gonna find out the night before when they're gonna start demo. And it could be tomorrow and it could be Thursday. I guess it's not tomorrow because we haven't heard from them, but I made the decision that I was gonna go ahead and move in. It will be nice to be all in one bathroom in the morning because normally I go to the bathroom over there. I'm gonna go to strip down into my room, come over here quickly shower and freeze my butt off, go back over there and finish everything else. And it was taking a lot of time because this shower takes some time to heat up. I can't start it while I'm getting undressed. I have to wait till I'm all oily or so. It will speed things up. And the shower's not cold anymore, but I am all moved into here. And this is a drawer, we got our countertop stuff going on. I'm gonna try not to make it messy when we have our new bathroom, but I will have like some jars. I'm gonna put my soap and this conditioner I keep out in no lotion. The soap and my lotion in just pretty bottles. Right now I have my lotion down there and I'm just gonna have to open that constantly and use it, but I don't wanna to put too much stuff on the counter. I'll make it work. Anyway. I'm going to take you over to the guest room, which has become our spot for delicate things that we need to store during this renovation. And we're a little annoyed by it, but so maybe we can move things over to the nursery at some point. But yeah, let's go see what I got at the thrift store. All right, it is rather dark in here. Sorry about that. I don't know if you're going to be able to really see anything, but I've got like mirrors. This is our new cabinet. Yeah, you can't see that at all. Hmm, I think Danny put new light bulbs in here. I stole one today. There we go. All right, so I got this hurricane lantern, I guess it's called. I already had this candle that I got on sale, I don't know, months and months and months ago. But I already knew I was gonna have oceany bathroom. It has rocks and this like oiled brass tray. I'm gonna paint that black. I need to get some black spray paint. And I think put sea glass down here. And then I'll have that candle. So that was one thing. I've already thrifted these sculptures. Which are really nice. They had the exact same fish, which I didn't like. But one of them was broken, so I just pulled the fish off. And I think what I'm gonna do is use clay to make a new tip of the coral. Or I can make a new tail for the fish and try to paint them into different colors. But I think I'm gonna just go with the coral route. 
I also already had this. This was my souvenir from the beach. This past trip when we went to the Outer Banks, this all moves around. But and guess what I found for $4.50 at the thrift store and the checkout lady was jealous. A mini one. It's its baby. And it's got a little sea star. So yeah. I'm really excited. They're exactly the perfect pair. I love it. So yeah, this is my candle from Cass, which I haven't burned yet because I keep forgetting to get a lighter to put up in the bathroom so I can have candles in the bath, but you better believe that I'm going to once it's all done. So I got those things. I also got a pair of shorts for Sebastian. I got three shirts for me and there was a new in package little mini four shooter nerf style gun it was a, a different brand the sticker said marshall's was six dollars and it was 350 new so we've been trying to do oh, my headphones are making noise we've been trying to do rewards for sebastian to get through the tests that he hadn't completed nice there I don't know. We've got a lot of storage going on here. And yesterday he earned a little Pokemon, Pokemon coin and a little set of water squirters as his prize for finishing a test and a bunch of worksheets. So again, he finished another test and some worksheets and he got that Nerf gun because he's been dying to play with Nerf guns and his friends have them and he didn't have one and he'd always come in and ask to use Danny's, which I say, no, they're dad's. I can't say yes to that because it's not my things and he's always like out when he asks. So he has his own. And I had him count the little darts and of course he came back with two less already after one time playing. So I'm like, tomorrow you need to look. <laughs> anyway. I'm just gonna finish up this video. I'm assuming they are not starting demo. Oh, these are the fancy bulbs. We've got like Edison bulbs that are LED. So these must be, yeah, those are our lights. All the fragiles are in here. Yeah, I might run some errands. I might get the spray paint and sea glass, or I might not. I didn't get a chance to vacuum up here. It took longer than anticipated to do everything I did. Like, the thrift store took long. Like, I swear I just spent half of it in line. People go there and buy, like, 50 to to $100 worth of stuff, and they're there every day because the people say, oh, hi, Bob. Yeah, see you tomorrow, Bob. <laughs> Like, they must be reselling and the thrift store does not care because they make their money and they're happy so good on them but if you want something you gotta hunt fast because they'll get it but yeah I don't know if I'm just gonna do more chores or if I'm going to run errands and maybe we'll do a little mix of both so we shall see but I'm gonna just say goodnight and I'll see you tomorrow so I can finish editing this and do my first bedtime in the hall bath, which was the ultimate plan, that bathroom first. So we have a bathroom to share while we do ours. And even though it's costing so much money, <laughs> we did save for years to do this. And we're happy to be having a contractor do it because it's going to go way faster than the multiple month project it would be if it was just Danny with me only being able to help a little bit. So, yeah. Good night, friends. Stay safe. Be kind. And don't forget. Watch your hands.